Hello boys and girls, this is Miss Mulkern again. So over the last couple of days, we have been working on Central Idea, Details and Response. So we've been using the book Far Above Earth. So today, we are going to take this same graphic organizer and I'm gonna give you a new article to do. I pulled an old magazine that I used to use in fourth grade with my students called Inside a Volcano. And so we are gonna look at a section and we're going to come up with the topic, the details, and the response. Now this is going to be your independent work and I'm going to get you started. Now, here is our magazine that we're going to use called Inside the Volcano. If you notice, you can automatically already see um, some different text features. We've got, over here we've got a map. We've got some photographs, some captions. We have some headings, um, some bolded print. Um, some of these words down here are bolded through our text. Um, we have an extra insert over here. We have a photograph right here with the caption um, below it, and here's our bolded print. Text features is something we're gonna be talking about next week, so you're really gonna see um, some more of these type text um, in our lessons. So first, we're gonna look at this Into the Volcano. Um, I'm gonna read underneath it as well. It says, Into the Volcano, Sam Crossman led a team of explorers more than a thousand feet down into one of the most active volcanoes in the world. I already know that this Into the Volcano is going to be about going in to a volcano. Pretty simple, right? So my whole topic is going to be about Into a Volcano. But this is the main topic, like of the whole article. Now, your job is not to do the whole article. No, that's too hard. We are only going to focus on one of these headings. So when we focus on one of these headings, you're going to read the heading. For example, this one says picture perfect. Well, picture perfect. Well, to me, I think of taking a really good picture. That would be kind of what I would think this was. This couple of paragraphs would be about. So you're going to read the first couple of sentences, figure out, okay, what is my topic? And now do I have details to back it up? So that is what you're going to do. I am actually going to give you that exact one. You are going to use picture perfect. It starts right here and that ends right here. So on your graphic organizer, you're going to make this on notebook paper. It's not that difficult. You don't have to have anything fancy. Um, you just have to draw a couple of lines. Um, you're going to do your topic, your details, your response. You are going to do section picture perfect. That means you're going to read this paragraph and this paragraph. That's one, two paragraphs and it continues over here. Now on the first paragraph, first couple of sentences, remember this is going to be somewhere in here is where you're going to find your central idea. Then you're gonna find details to back it up. Now remember, your topic, this right here, is called Central Idea. What it is mainly about, what it's centered about. Then your details, they have to back up your Central Idea, okay? And then your response is going to be any connection um, that you have, anything that it reminds you of, um, any other story that you may have read. So your directions, one more time, just in case. You're gonna draw this graphic organizer. We're gonna read the section, we're gonna talk about Into a Volcano, which is our main topic, but the section you are going to focus on today is Picture Perfect. It has two paragraphs. You're going to read this, you're gonna come up with your central idea and the details to support it. You're going to put that into your graphic organizer, you're going to upload a picture into Canvas.